Hello, I'm David Williams, a very proud principal at Pensacola High School. This advertisement, this video, is to invite those applicants who would like to be our head football coach here at Pensacola High School. We have a rich tradition here at Pensacola High School of producing outstanding football teams and athletes here. We're looking for someone who can re-energize our community, our school, and get people excited about being a part of something special here at Pensacola High School in the football program. You will hear more details from our athletic director, Mr. Casey Tealy, and our assistant principal, Mr. Brian Freeman, of the specifics of the job and requirements. But we want someone that's gonna come here to Pensacola High School and be a step above the rest, and that's gonna employ our student body and our faculty and staff to be proud of the product that we put out on the football field. We hope that you will join us here at Pensacola High School. We hope that you'll put your applications in. Deadline is December the 8th. Only those who fully fill out an application with HR will be interviewed. So make sure you get your application in by December the 8th and go Tigers. Hello, I'm Brian Freeman, the assistant principal at Pensacola High School. I want to talk about the mandatory requirements for our head coach position. Um, the first and most important is that each head coach candidate must have a teaching certification. And if you do not, you have to be eligible for certification in PE. So we're looking for our coaching candidates to have a teacher certification in PE. We also expect for our head coach to have at least three years of experience as a coach at the varsity level. That's going to be very important. So just make sure that if you're applying for the position that you have at least three years experience at the varsity level. Our preferred candidate would uh, have previously been an offensive or defensive coordinator at the high school level or at the collegiate level. So we do prefer that our applicants have offensive coordinator or defensive coordinator experience. Also, they'll be able to recruit quality assistant coaches. We want to have the best opportunities for our young men at the, at the high school level, so we want to make sure that our head coach also has some good quality assistant coaches that they can bring on board. Also, we want you to have previously been in a program that has turned around in a positive direction direction. So we certainly want you to have experience of coming into a program and doing what needs to be done to turn it around. And lastly, a coach that can use our social media platforms. Um, I think we live in an age today where social media is vital. So we want our head coach to be able to promote and market the program and the great things that are going on at Pensacola High School. So we do expect for our candidate to have a strong sense of of promotion and marketing on social media. Hi, I'm Casey Teeley. I'm the athletic director for Pensacola High School. I'd lock, like to talk about the two challenges that uh, our next head football coach, all of our head football coaches in the past have had, but, but we need to have a plan uh, with our next head football coach. Number one, when kids enter the program at Pensacola High School as a freshman, Escambia County School District does not have a middle school feeder program, okay? So you may have kids that have played some rec ball, uh, organized rec ball, which is at a high level in the state of Florida, obviously, but it's not organized high school football like you're going into. So you've got a coaching staff of nine uh, assistant coaches plus the head coach. How are you gonna organize that staff to take those kids that are have no skills, teach them skills and then have your elite athletes that are seniors, how are you going to organize that coaching staff and, and bring those kids in? Because if they have a successful experience as a freshman, they can continue on as a sophomore, junior and senior. Conversely, the problem is when students leave your program, they're seniors, they graduate, how would you give them an opportunity uh, to go to the next level, to play at the junior college level, to play at the NEIA level, to play at the NCAA level? How are you gonna help those families uh, that haven't been through this before? Many times this will be the first one in their family that's went on to play college football or go to college. And uh, every one of them wants to go there. How would you help them, coach? That's, that's the plan that we need. So anyway, go Tigers, and I wish you the best of luck. And also to our app, because just want to tell you that you need to have a full application. Please visit the Scammy County School District Human Resource page. Go in there and fill out a full application. Make sure all of your transcripts and experience and resumes is uploaded and so that you will qualify to be interviewed here at Pensacola High School. Also, you'll be able to contact HR for the salary range so you will have that information as well and what requirements you need to be certified to teach in the state of Florida and also in Scammy County. And go Tigers.